So how do we ensure this balance between um, activities such as mining and tourism? Of course, one dependent on extracting resources and the other very much dependent on protecting them. Okay, well, I think there's a, mul a number of things here. One, there's a number of good practices that we can draw upon, uh, restoration, mitigation of risk, uh, both environmental as, as well as social risk. Um, those need to be built into the regulations, those need to be monitored, those need to draw on a variety of, of expertise. At the same time, it's very important to recognize, uh, and this was the points made during the forum quite regularly, the importance of diversifying. In activities such as ecotourism are, are very important in terms of generating an income particularly and, and increasing the value of the natural resource base. At the same time, it is not a very resilient um, uh, investment in many ways. It's very open to global changes in the economy. It's very open to political shifts. Agriculture is, is also very equally important, food security, but doing it in a manner that is climate resilient, climate smart and sustainable and therefore will also equally protect the environment. And at the same time, the functions and the roles of protected areas should not be lost and, and um, we need to continue to press the case for them. Protected areas provide a variety of services not only for the existing situation but also for future generations and, and host a variety of resources of which a lot of which we're not even aware of.